I feel like this looks better than the looks I usually wear. <laughs> I really like it. Cool. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I have no words. I don't know what to say. That's crazy. Vlog. Hey everyone, I'm Huda Katan and today I'm fact checking beauty tutorials. I love how dramatic her, eyelash, her eyeshadow is. It's so pretty. She's got amazing brows. This is definitely, I think, a look that I wore probably around the time that we launched the Smoky Palette. I feel like we really do get inspired by our palettes and we do looks inspired by them. That liner is definitely something I love. I love that really long, extreme liner. She looks gorgeous. I see a lot of Huda inspiration in the eyes here. <laughs> the heavy liner, the lots of lashes, the shine on the eyelid, that's definitely something that I love to do all the time, <laughs> pretty much every single day if I can. Um, she looks stunning, I love it. Kalima, I love this look so much. It's so beautiful. Your eyes look so insanely gorgeous. I feel like they're a little like mesmerizing. <laughs> I love them, you look so beautiful. I saw her stuff too when she was wearing that yeah, outfit. Is she actually watching this? I love. <laughs> she's got amazing brows. Aww. Oh my god, I can't believe she That's watched cute. my video. <laughs> That's amazing. So sweet. This is really, really beautiful. You did. Oh my gosh, thank that you. liner is definitely <laughs> something I love. I love that really long, extreme liner. Yeah. yeah. She looks gorgeous. I love, we love liner. That's definitely see. like the liner that I love. I go way extreme with my liner. Actually, that looks really similar to our packaging, um, which I really, really love. Oh my Kalima, gosh. I love this look so much. It's so beautiful. Your eyes look so insanely gorgeous. I feel like they're a little like mesmerizing. <laughs> I love them, you look so beautiful. Oh my god, Thank you for doing an inspired tutorial. Oh, oh you should be so proud. You did such an amazing job. It's amazing. I, I wouldn't ever thought that she would ever see it. She's got sisters like uh, Alia and Mona, and I've got sisters. It just reminds me of um, us, really. And she's so hardworking. She's just really inspiring, and she and her makeup her, is always yeah, she created her, her the own. best. She created her own company and stuff. That's what we want to do yeah. as well. I love that she's a Muslim because yeah. you don't see much Muslims like being that successful yeah. and just showing like you can do it. No, yeah. Nothing's going to stop you. Oh my gosh, Hida, I can't believe you saw my video. I am really, I'm so, I can't, I just can't <laughs> believe it. I started crying. <laughs> and I love the fact that you took your time out and actually watched her video. Yeah. I actually did pull out this baby for this look, the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk Palette. She's so pretty, like how can you not love this palette? Oh, Lizelle, you're so sweet. Oh my God, her skin is so beautiful. I don't think she even needs foundation, to be honest. Tell me what you put on your skin, I wanna know. It's really important that when you're working with such bright, intensely colored shadows, you don't wanna go balls deep in it straight away. You kinda just wanna work up to it. I love that she gets transition shades because it's really important to kind of have something that you can kind of blend. A lot of times when you use very strong pigments, it actually makes it harder to blend. It makes it harder to do like that smokiness and it makes it look really harsh. So I love that she understands that. She knows her stuff. The purples, the reds. Desert Dusk was a really important palette for us. Um, it was really something that we wanted to kind of experiment with and this look is stunning. It's so beautiful. I love that this is like kind of dramatic but still perfect for every day. Everything looks really harmonious, really beautiful. And she still looks like she can go like day to night. Lizelle, you are so beautiful. Keep doing your tutorials, girl. And please let me know what you use on your skin. Your skin is flawless. Or kiss your mama, I don't know. One or the other. <laughs> I actually did pull out this baby for this look, the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk Palette. She's so pretty, like how can you not love this gorgeous. palette? It's so gorgeous. Oh, Lizelle, you're so my name. Oh my, oh my God, her skin is so beautiful. I don't think she even needs foundation, to be honest. I love her oh. accent. She's just sweet and cute. I like want to keep watching her. She, I just think she looks stunning. Everything looks really harmonious, really beautiful. And she still looks like she can go like day to night. Oh. Lizelle, you are so beautiful. Keep doing your tutorials, girl. And please let me know what you use on your skin. Your skin is flawless. Or kiss your mama. I don't know. One or the other. Wow, that's awesome. I'm just shocked that she like saw my video, to be honest. Because there's so many people who have done looks with her palette and to see that specific one and like have her recognize it and appreciate it, like it it means a lot to me. How she really came from humble beginnings. 
like started from the ground up and now she is where she is. I find it really inspiring to see that and like see any success from anyone in this industry. It makes me feel like I can do that as well. Hoda, thank you so much for appreciating what I did in that video and super like grateful and excited and happy that you recognize my work and it really means a lot to me. And if just looking at the palette doesn't make you happy, then like who are you? <laughs> Oh, I love you. I'm gonna make sure I do hit that inner corner of the eye so when we cut the crease, it's gonna be really noticeable. I like her. She's like funny and quirky and cute, but she like knows her stuff as well. This is so beautiful. I like that she did like a half cut crease. She didn't go all the way through. It's really beautiful. I am like all about like an insane eyeliner. So for me, I like, I wear it every day. I wear it to the gym. So I appreciate a really insane eyeliner. Get the eyeliner, girl. Oh, I love this. I feel like this is still me <laughs> today. Um, I love this look so much, it's so beautiful. It looks a little Middle Eastern inspired, um, very, very warm, the pinks, the reds. I like that she's a little daring, you know, the fact that she likes to mix so many colors in a palette, the fact that she likes to embrace the culture that we, you know, we really took people on this journey with that palette and I like that she embraced it. And I think she like really did a great job with a cut crease. I, I normally don't always like a cut crease and I feel like I love the way she did it. The fact that she applied a little concealer over her lid um, to make sure she had a little bit more of a precise crease um, line. And it's really amazing because it just makes the eyeshadow pop a little bit more. I think she did such a beautiful job. Amy, I love the fact that you take so many risks with your makeup. You look so beautiful. I love this look. Thank you so much for, you know, just killing this makeup. You look great. This is one of my favorite looks that we did. I remember this look because this is like when we first launched Rose Gold and we wanted something that would kind of be you know, a little special and also like really, really metallic. I think we were really obsessing over metallics at the time. And so we were playing with golds and pinks. Ah, oh, I love this. She looks beautiful and I love this. I actually like her look more than mine. I think she looks stunning. Her brows look beautiful. Her eyes look gorgeous. I love it. She did a beautiful job. Janisha, I love you. Thank you for recreating one of my favorite looks of all time. You look absolutely stunning. This is one of my favorite looks that we did. Janisha, I love you, you're so cute. She's got beautiful skin too. What's up with all these girls and this good skin? <laughs> okay, I'm excited to see this. Aw, oh I love this. She looks beautiful. This is our first rose gold. This was a really important palette to us because this was our first palette of all times. Um, and I love this. I actually like her look more than mine. I think she looks stunning. Her brows look insane. I love it. She looks beautiful. Janisha, I love you. Thank you for recreating one of my favorite looks of all time. You look absolutely stunning. That's crazy. What? That's mad. I actually still feel like that's not like her. <laughs> she said my name and said that she liked it and appreciated it. and. That is pretty, it's pretty amazing. She's inspirational because I suppose the empire that she's built. Thanks Hoda for watching the video. Um, thank you for making such amazing products. Thank you for being so inspiring and kind of showing us that anything's possible uh, if you put your mind to it. Thank you for watching. I really want to do a video on Huda Beauty. Like, I literally love everything she does. Her makeup always looks so flawless. Oh. My day-to-day -day makeup is, like, most of the time inspired by her. If she's ever watched my video, like, watches my video, I'm literally gonna die. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> okay, I love the contour. I feel like we look alike. I'm gonna do a Casey Inspire tutorial. She's amazing skin, too. I use blusher all the time now. I never used to until I started watching Hudo. Aw, Casey, I love you! Yes, I love you, you're so sweet. And this look, she's killing it, I love it. I actually love blush and I love to put it all over my face. I feel like it really warms up the face, so I put it all over and I just love the way she did it. I, like, I can see hints of it on the forehead, which I think is a place that people really neglect. 
Casey, you killed this look. You look so beautiful. And you're just, you're radiant. And I just love watching your tutorial. I wanna meet you one day. You know, to anyone out there who's definitely been inspired by any of our products or our makeup looks, you know, it's really touching. And I think it's really great that we all get to kind of be inspired from each other. And I think it's important to definitely take risks, have some fun with some colors, create some art, you know, with your face. So um, I loved watching all the tutorials today and I can't wait to see everyone's looks out there. I love you guys so much.